At the Nick at Night Broadcast Control Center, highly skilled technicians are coordinating the sophisticated equipment that will bring you and your family an entire evening of classic television. These are the top broadcast engineers in the industry, tireless workers who utilize only the finest in state-of-the-art equipment. Now, stand by for Nick at Night. Tonight, Nick at Night continues our epic journey through TV history as we celebrate our 10th anniversary. It's your one chance to enjoy this lineup of TV classics. Get Smart, Patty Duke, Dobie Gillis, The Best of Saturday Night Live, Alfred Hitchcock Presents, Superman, and Fernwood Tonight. And it's only on Nick at Night, America's first and only classic TV network. Moments in Nick at Night history. August 9th, 1990. For the very first time, Nick at Night delivers Milkman to America's doorstep. I like to drink it cold. Yes, set forth on a quest from TV land, Milkman brings truth and justice in his hand by delivering milk and hope to a world gone sour. It's Milkman! for that. Be good to your fellow man. That's all the payment I ask. Always there when you need him most. That's wrong, man. But you two go out and have a good time tonight. On me. Gosh, thanks, Milkman. A hero for the TV generation. Milkman. Another first from America's first classic TV network, Nick at Night. Land. They spoke to the TV generation. They've been called wacky, irreverent, even annoying. They are those Nick at Night promos. Ten years of better living through television. Hi, I'm Rich Cronin, general manager of Nick at Night. What you're about to see is a half hour of commercials. But don't touch that dial because there are commercials. The on-air promos that have peppered Nick at Night's classic TV lineup from 1985 until today. For the next half hour, to celebrate 10 years of serving the TV generation, we present our 30 favorite Nick at Night commercials. After a long day when you've been to heck and back, coming home to TV land feels good. You work plenty hard, mister, so relax. Fire up your pipe, then say how do you do to some old friends. And seconds, please, to some home-style cooking. Come on, there'll be good times, groovy times, the kind you'll always remember long after you've lost your mind. Hello out there. From TV land, your home away from home every night on Nick at Night. The Stones. They've been together over 20 years. The Stones. They've been through some hard times, but they're still going strong. The Stones. Now you can catch them on Nick at Night. Jeff, Mary, Alex, and Donna. The Stones. The perfect American family. I'm a goody goody. Get a front row seat to The Stones. Watch The Donna Reed Show every night on Nick at Night. TV Land's contented streets lies a sidewalk jungle of youth gone wild. There you'll find the bad boys of good TV. Jeff Stone, only his hair cream is more explosive. You call me out once more, I'm gonna tear you apart. Robbie Douglas, Teen Terror Unleashed. I'll fix you, wise guy, you wait. Dobie Gillis. A genuine, all-out, juvenile delinquent. High school Hellcat. Men fear me because I'm menacing and destructive. They're making their own rules and playing for keeps. You tried, I dare you. Every night on Nick at Night. Criminals of Metropolis. Nick at Night knows that fighting Superman means staying in shape, but often you just don't have the time. That's why there's the Jimmy Olsen 30-minute workout. No matter what shape you're in, you can always get in a brisk upper body workout by beating Jimmy up every night of the week. Only a special guy would take it on the chin for you. But that's just how much Jimmy cares. The Jimmy Olsen 30-minute workout. One more reason Metropolis thugs watch The Adventures of Superman. Weeknights at 8.30, 7.30 Central on Nick at Night. With it! Real with it! Joe Friday is the now look! Sure. He's what's happening! Uh -huh.
comes in two formulas, Mog and Ultra Mog. Joe Friday. I'm keeping the faith, baby. On Dragnet, every night on Nick at Night. Hey, that guy's really great. <clears throat> now we'll take a break from all these commercials for some regular commercials and then back to some more commercials when we return. Nick at Night, celebrating our 10th anniversary by putting together the single greatest one-week lineup in the history of television. Yes, you'll get hand-selected episodes of virtually every show we've ever aired. Everything from the episode of Make Room for Daddy that launched The Andy Griffith Show to the laugh-in that featured Richard Nixon. Sock it to me? Don't miss our 10th anniversary week. All this week at 8, 7 central, only on Nick at Night. Welcome back to a batch of old promotional spots slapped together to make a special we call those Nick at Night promos. Ten years of better living through television. See? That's honesty. Nick and I believe that honesty is vital and that an informed viewer is our best customer. Here are some spots that provided the whole truth and nothing but the truth. Sort of. After watching The Donna Reed Show, do you ever have the uncontrollable desire to go out and do good? Beware. Nick at Night scientists have discovered powerful subliminal messages embedded in The Donna Reed Show. In the interest of your free will, we have slowed down this Donna Reed footage. See for yourself. Read so much more than meets the eye every night on Nick at Night. Nick at Night presents Secrets of Mr. Ed. Did Mr. Ed really talk? The answer, yes. In reality, it was Wilbur who required electrical shocks to perform his comedy lines. Would today's push-button phones prevent Mr. Ed from dialing long distance? The answer, no. The divestiture of AT&T makes long distance dialing a reality for everyone. Did Mr. Ed perform his own stunts? The answer, no. His stunts were performed by Dirty Dancing star Patrick Swayze. Was there only one Mr. Ed? Yes, the one and only original talking horse on Nick at Night. Nick at Night presents the How Powerful is Samantha Answer Man. Dear Answer Man, could Samantha create a boulder so heavy she herself couldn't lift it? No, but can she ever parallel park? Answer Man, if Samantha is so powerful, why doesn't she do something about Darren's looks? She did try once. I want my own face back! I want my own face back! I want my own face back! Bewitched, it's more than TV, it's Tinka Tinka Tea. TV, weeknights on Nick at Night. Many have blustered and many scowled, but only Reuben shifted his hair. Watch it again. That's the Reuben hair shift, and it's part of our television heritage. Reuben Kincaid was a classic TV curmudgeon like Perry White and Mr. Mooney, but only Reuben had the hair shift. It said joy, resignation, concern, satisfaction. Wonderful. <laughs> Look for the patented Reuben hair shift on the Partridge family here on Nick at Night. Whether it's caused by a board, a box, or even a violin, it's TV's most unforgettable affliction, and it's part of our television heritage. What is it, Dr. Amnesia? It sure is, and it's TV's favorite neurological disorder. Amnesia? Superman's had it. Who is Superman? Max did, too. Who are you people? What do you want? What am I doing here? And Lucy, Rob, Agarn, even Flipper. Amnesia. And he's lost his memory? Amnesia. It's part of our television heritage. Look for it on Nick at Night. The next chart maker on Nick at Night's rerun countdown was so popular when it premiered that it inspired a popular fad that's still with us today. No, not coonskin caps or hula hoops. The answer in a moment. Nick at Night's 1989 rerun countdown. Until the mid-50s, wild dogs roamed America, surviving on their own, only entering people's homes long enough to steal the occasional slipper. But our next show showed people that dogs could be obedient, faithful companions. And in just a few years, dogs replaced antelopes as America's most popular house pet. The show, of course, was Lassie. And in this episode, he meets a man from Mars. Nick at Night's 1989 rerun countdown. Number 23. 
The annual countdown show with Casey Kasem has become a tradition, six years and counting. But not all our on-air events have been such a hit. There was Cinco de Mayo, episodes with the original Spanish dubbing. <laughs> Wild Irish Bub, my three sons tinted green for St. Patrick's Day. The Do-It-Yourself sitcom, a contest in which real viewers' lives were turned into sitcoms. And of course, pretty picture frame night when a cheap graphic overlay was put over our broadcast all night long. But more often than not, our on-air stunts and commercials did their jobs, from the humblest lineup spot all the way to the mightiest campaign. What's on TV, sis? Crummy network reruns. Hey, you. <laughs> they sure smell the second time around. You bet they do. You should watch Nick at Night brand reruns with patented Duraplay coating, the modern wonder that keeps stories fresh and characters from going bad. Nick at Night with patented Duraplay. I like it. Crummy <laughs> reruns just are it right. Make the switch to Nick at Night brand reruns. Watch Nick at night for good TV. Try him once and you'll agree. Half an hour is a handy length. Classics brewed at double strength. Nick at night brand reruns are good TV every night, 365 days a year. That's what makes us tops in friendly satisfaction. Big TV pleasure in every bite. Make the switch to Nick at Listen to viewers across the land say, hey, make mine the Nick at Night brand. Non-slip shows for viewer attraction, tops in friendly satisfaction. What do we mean by friendly satisfaction? Good TV all night, every night. And that's just what Nick at Night delivers. Big TV pleasure in every bite. Make the switch to Nick at Night. Brand reruns. Good old Dixie, the Nick at Night Pixie. She's one among an elite core, a select few who can proudly say, we've been Nick at Night spokespeople. From the Taxi Appreciation Week guy, way back to Lloyd Lindsay Young. From Dr. Will to the guys in these spots. Meet the people I'm at crazy. Nick at Night who bring you good TV. You're crazy. Hi, <laughs> I'm Bob Middleman, producer. Hello, producer. Big deals, the coast. But you know why I love this business? Because I love good TV. Like the time Wilbur was willing to give Mr. Ed away. Let me take you back. Ed, don't move. I want to remember you just like that. That's good TV. That's Nick at night. We're going to find another talking horse. Hello. I've been looking all over for you. What's wrong? It's my mother. She's having real trouble adjusting to the changes in the new Nick at Night fall schedule. She says she'll never make it. What do you think? I want to come with you. I think your mother's going to need your help. But what do I do? Tell her to try watching Laugh-In at 10 and... Yes? Tell her you love her. The new Nick at Night fall schedule. It's here. Adam West for Nick at Night. I'm going to put this ordinary chicken inside a football helmet to make a simple point. Some things just don't make sense, like watching network TV. Wake up. Good TV, like Mr. Ed and Dobie Gillis, are your guarantee of big TV pleasure. It makes a heck of a lot more sense than a chicken in a football helmet. Because other networks stink out right stay shower fresh with Nick at Night. Brand the spokesmen weren't the only stars who did their bit for Nick at Night. From Captain Lou Albano to Gene Rayburn. From Mayor Ed Koch to Jimmy J.J. Walker. Dino my! Big stars, yes. But Nick at Night has never really been about stars. It's been about you, the viewer, and what Nick at Night could do to help. How we could provide better living through television. Your boss is a butthead. The sun is a dying star. You stink at bridge. Car 54 can help. Ooh, ooh. Count on Nick at night. What would be the best job in the world? I don't know. Watching TV for a living? Exactly. And that's exactly the job Nick at Night wants to open up to you, the TV generation. Manager of acquisitions? That's right. We're hiring. And if you're the TV brainiac we're looking for, this could be your office. 
This could be your secretary. This could be your job. Watching TV and choosing shows for Nick at Night? Wow, that's for me. For details, stay tuned to Nick at Night. I will. The perfect home, the perfect husband, the perfect family. Television taught you it would be like this someday. And now it can be as Nick at Night shows you how to be Donna Reed. It's a five-part home study in the fine art of being Donna. The road to excellence can be messy. Oh. <laughs> so let Nick at Night transform you into the perfect woman you always wanted to be. How to be Donna Reed. Tune in two minutes before 9.30 all next week only on Nick at Night. Nick at Night, as a public service, presents How to Be So Well, an instructional series dedicated to better living through television. Tonight's segment, Avoiding Unwanted Relatives. The warning sounds. You have only seconds to prepare. What will you do when faced with unwanted relatives? No one likes to be mean, but unwanted relatives make you want to... Oh, you know, but what can you do? It's easy when you face the crisis calmly. As soon as you hear unwanted relatives approach, act fast. The first job is to close the curtains, unplug appliances that might make noise, lock all doors and shut them tight. Shut off the furnace, then head for the basement and sit tight until the emergency is over. Learn these simple steps. Do practice drills with your family. Soon you too will be avoiding unwanted relatives and everything will be so well. Sent forth on a quest from TV Land. Bringing truth and justice in his hand. Delivering milk and hope to a world gone sour. It's milk man. Tonight's episode, Presto Changeo. 25 cents, please. Why the long face, tall booth man? I'm fat. I hate being fat. Maybe you should try some skim milk. Maybe you should shut up, you flaming jerkhead. Well, I don't know about Jerkhead, but play mom. <sighs> you know, I used to be a bit chunky myself, man. Then one day I decided, whenever I felt the urge to snack, I'd learn a new magic trick instead. Now I feel fit and can make the most wondrous things happen. A quarter! Hey! Hey, you forgot this! Milkman and Nick at Night, dedicated to better living through television. Those Nick at Night promos, 10 years of better living through television, will be back after these messages. There's no better way to enjoy classic TV than with Nick at Night's Block Party Summer. It's more than perfect, it is inspired. Let Nick at Night fill your plate with hearty six episode blocks of your favorite shows every weeknight all summer long. No goody, 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 goody. Monster Mondays, Lucy Tuesdays, Bewitched Be Wednesdays, Genie Thursdays, and Cotter Fridays. Hey, that's a great idea. So come back for seconds, thirds, fourths, fifths, even sixths during Nick at Night's Block Party Summer starting July 3rd here on Nick at Night. In case you joined us late, what you're watching is promos, and nothing but promos. A special presentation we call those Nick at Night promos. Ten years of better living through television. Our time is nearly up. But before we go, we'll reveal two of the secrets to making a Nick at Night promo. The first is, if in doubt, put a dog in the spot. Jeff. Would you rather be invisible or have the power to talk to animals? Invisible. Why? Sneak into the girls' locker room. Mm. I mean, what if animals only knew knock-knock jokes? Yeah, but what if they were all like Mr. Ed? And what if they all turned out to be like Bub? Well, you never know. Bub could be as smart as Mr. Peabody. Bub, master of time and space. Mm. He could be. Honey, he barely knows how to work the VCR. Sent forth on a quest from TV land. Bringing truth and justice in his hand. Delivering milk and hope to a world gone sour. It's milk man. Tonight's episode, Crazy Dog. Hiya, Mac. Gee, you look a little bit down in the dumps. Something wrong? Nah. Well, it's my dog, Milkman. He's crazy. Crazy? <laughs> This cute old pooch? How you doing, boss? That's not my dog. That's my dog. Oh, that 
dog. Now, that dog is crazy. But you know, crazy or not, I think I know just the place for your dog. Where? The Metropolitan Opera. Milkman and Nick at Night, dedicated to better living through television. How can you help Nick at Night in preserving our television heritage? This is Friday, Joe Friday, Dobie Gillis, and that's 86 and 99. The next time you choose a pet's name, why not look to your TV heritage? Little Mel here thinks it's a great idea. And maybe, just maybe, you could honor your television heritage when a blessed event arrives. We're calling him Agarn. Would mean a lot to Nick at Night and to our television heritage. The second secret to making Nick at Night promos? It's simply this. When everything to say about a show has been said, sing it instead. Join the My Three Sons sing along. Oh, my three sons, yes, my three sons. It's my three sons on Nick at Night. They've got a dad, his name is Steve. He's got a job, he's really tall. And then there's Bob, he makes them food. They've got a dog, they're my three sons. Nick at Night. Nick at Night gives us Patty Duke asking the musical question. Tell me, Mama, what to do. Figure it out. Patty Duke, every night on Nick at Night. I got the main energy blue. Go to not me, be pop, bohemian, and I need blues. I got the main energy blues. The wish musician and be the condition blues. Once he was cast off, he'll again. Now he's Nick at Night, black and white, and I'm thrilled again. Feel the chill is. Watch it, Toby Gillis. Sing the main energy blues. I hope you enjoyed our look back at 10 years of Nick at Night promos. And I hope you keep watching our promos. Not that you have much choice, because they'll be right where they always are. At the beginning, middle, and end of the best darn shows ever made. The classic TV shows of Nick at Night. You're going bald. Your feet are huge. Yes, you're Bozo's love child. Second City TV can help. How are you? Count on Nick at Night. When a fellow named Chris Viscardi made his special request for a 1990 rerun countdown, we simply could not fulfill it. Until Company Brass gave us a special waiver and allowed us to show our next episode. For Chris. Stay tuned. Nick at Night's 1990 rerun countdown. You know, ordinarily we take special requests and dedications only from viewers and not from employees or their families. But when Chris Viscardi asked for the America Tonight with Carol Burnett, well, we had to make an exception. Why? Well, Chris has worked at Nick at Night for years, started out as a fresh-faced gopher and worked his way up. But, well, times are tough all over. The recession, you know. And Chris, we're gonna have to let you go. Sorry, Chris, but at least this is our way of saying thanks. Thanks for seven years of dedication and loyalty. Sit back and enjoy your favorite episode of America Tonight. I'm so glad we had this time together. <laughs>